The first day, I told my mother to be more precise, to be more correct, the best friend of my life. She told me, maybe she didn't knew what is the meaning of LGBTIQH. She didn't know these words also. She was bedridden for four years due to osteoporosis. And I told her, you know, I'm not your son. She said, what are you? I said, I'm a woman trapped in the body of man. I call myself as Anurag Moitre. I am a social activist and a performing artist. I didn't find a single way to make my mind according to my body. At first, I thought, okay, let's make my mind according to my body. Many suggested to consult me to a psychiatrist. Even my father, once he took me to a psychiatrist, I was in a terrible, solitary confinement. With whom shall I disclose my likings, my dislikings, my problems, my solitude, my pain, my agony, my happiness? I was nowhere. So I thought, before giving it a second thought, I took a resolution. No, I will walk according to my, the needs, the true needs of my mind and my soul. Gradually, I started dressing up in the way as I like to see myself. But it was very disappointing for my father, he, he felt very embarrassed because I'm the single child of my parents. When I told him, he fastly he said that it's not accepted in India, in Calcutta. And what is the future of this kind of relationships? Okay, he told me, okay, it, it's, you might love a guy but that guy will not love you as a girl, as a woman because you don't have a female genitalia. Actually, you don't need to know where the destination is, what is the destination all about. The journey is very important. My relationship with Moitri is more of the journey, the happiness of the journey together. And I see her more of as of a complementary existence of mine. So, 377, to me, it doesn't only involve the queer community, but it affects any person, irrespective of any sexual order. So, as a civilized citizen of India, as a healthy thinker of our country, we must fight against this patriarchal, hegemonic, barbaric law through some It's my honest request to all the parents of the LGBTIQ community or to understand, realize the feelings of their children, not only as a parent, as a man or a woman, but as a friend, as a human being. Yes, not I, not you. It is we, the queer community, together with all our love, our efforts, we can bring a better